Hey y'all, it's Yoli 1976. I know I'm looking kind of crazy, y'all. Looking ugly this week because um, I have a cold sore over here. And um, I have a bump over here. My face is going through some changes right now. And um, I just choose not to put any makeup on. But uh, I can't take this. It, I look this whole... <laughs> I would be able to take it better without makeup if I didn't have this cold sore. And this bump sitting on the side of my face. I mean, it's a big one too. I'm gonna show y'all, but um, I just need something to make me feel better because I'm feeling real ugly this week with all that going on. Um, yeah. Uh, so I just got away. I did a little shopping today, and let me get us some music. And remember, I told y'all that <laughs> think outside of the box. I listen to all types of music. So, whatever touches my heart, that's what I listen to. And this one is one of my favorites, I swear. I know I got a lot of favorites, but this is. Um, Y'all hear that? So, yeah, anyway. And the reason why I got my wig cap and no wig is because my, um, I bought a wig. And I'm going to. This probably be three videos. I don't know. I'm gonna put it on and we're gonna double dab and play around with this wig. Um, but first, I just want to say, what is going on with these little girls and the way they dress? Huh? I was on my way back home and this little girl had on some black shorts, some black stockings, not tights. Okay. I, I would accept it better if she had on tights, but they were sheer stockings. And um, they had, like, let me take it back. Not sheer. They were um, fishnets. And they had some type of snake design going down the front. And she had on some kind of boots and a little shirt. And she looked like she was no more than 15. Okay? And she had body, but. I'm looking at her from a mother perspective. You know, if she coming out and she look like she on a block, some nasty old man probably looking at her the same way. And she's walking out here with her little girlfriend who ain't no better. And she just, I mean, I don't understand. Mothers, what's going on? You letting your babies out like this now? Your little girls, your precious jams? Come on, we gotta teach our children to love their self better than that. We don't have, they don't have to expose us. I always tell my little cousins and, you know, um, little cousins and them that, you know, as women, we don't have to expose our body to get attention. You'll get the wrong kind of attention. The girl with their butt cheeks hanging out, the black of their butt cheeks hanging out, okay, and their cleavage like this. <laughs> yeah, okay, they get the wrong attention. The guys want to take them to the bedroom, but if you just cover it up some and look ladylike, that's the one that say that's wifey material, you know. They'll give you more respect, you know. And um, for a while, as a young girl, I, I never really dressed like that myself. But I did wear low cleavage at one point because I wanted attention from the boys. But I had to learn that that is not the way. And I wasn't no young, I wasn't no 15 years old though. I was like in my 20s and so I had to learn that that's not the way to get attention. You know, that's the wrong kind of attention. So if any young ladies listening, Please put some clothes on. You don't want that type of attention. We can be sexy without exposing our skin. Okay, it's too much out here anyway. It's the music ain't right. You know, booty clapping and <sighs> put your thong on and shake your rump this way. No, they not respecting us anyway. So don't put yourself out there. No more than people already putting themselves out there. But just be ladylike. Okay, because what I seen today was very disturbing. Little girls dressing like that. And where these little girls get off wearing these four inch heels at 15 and 16? Mm -mm. 
I wasn't even allowed to wear heels at that age. Please, really. And when I did get of age, I never wore no four inch heels. <laughs> Just, trust me, they bring pain to your foot, so don't even rush trying to be grown. It's, it's, just be a child, y'all, as long as you can. It ain't worth rushing, trust me. So getting back to my mini haul. Well, I ain't gonna call it a mini haul. <laughs> I'm gonna show y'all what I got. I went to Fashion Bug today, okay? And by all means, I bought everything with my money, so. And Fashion Bug has a 40% off sale. Plus, the stuff already been marked down. So, these shoes that I'm about to show y'all were um, $24.99. Can you see that? And they marked down to $18.74, but take 40% off of that. And for y'all big girls, us big girls. You know, we cannot be rocking heels like that, like the skinny girls. That I mean, some of us can and some of us can't. Certain kind of heels and because we got so much weight on us. But we still want to be cute and sexy with our heels. So these shoes are perfect. You see that? And look at the heel cute and sexy stylish and y'all they come in wide width for a full figure girl we got wide feet they come in wide width i think and they the material that's made it's like a a satin material so you want to make sure you don't step in no mud or nothing you know and the bottom of it let me show y'all that is um has that like grip now some shoes are like real slick and you be sliding across the floor especially when it rain i wouldn't wear these in the rain anyway but you just slide across the floor but not these these got a little rubber grip so you don't slide even on the heel so the heel is like patent leather and then they got satin material for that zebra look and then it has a buckle let's see if i can and on the toe part is I'm patent leather down here and you see the buckle and your toes out so you can wear these now they're summer shoes but um you can still wear these now because it's warm it's pretty warm out and for the price that they cost I wouldn't care if I can wear them now or not I can put them up for later and then I got these I'm into the animal print. I know I told y'all I'm not an animal print person. And y'all seen that animal print back there. That is because that was a happy medium for me and my fiance. Uh -uh. And I've been wearing animal print clothes. Because I don't know. It just grew on me. And I love it. So I guess this is what you call the cheetah. Same style. Except the material is like a velour material. Okay. And the heels check the heel out it's just a little heel still sexy and it still had grip at the bottom and the heel is patent leather and it's patent leather right there with your toes in it. and it's a buckle and um like i said it's that velour material so i thought that was cute even the girl in the store was like it's cute, you better get it. I mean, she was saying it, not saying it to be trying to get me buy something because they don't work off commission, they will pay hourly. Just saying it like they're cute, so touch their sale. You know, I said. So, also, while I was at Fashion Bullet, they had the buy one. Somebody opened my door. Hold on, y'all. Huh? When you done your homework, kids, go ahead. Shut my door. So yeah, sorry, that's my son. Um, what else? While I was there, 
I got another one of these because they have 40% off already marked down clothes or you get um buy one and get the other one y'all don't give me a line about this sale <laughs> and if you buy any purchase I know it's just buy one and you get the other one I don't want to say half off or I don't know something like that but I went on the 40% off rack off the already marked down clothes because that's just me <laughs> I love sale and also if you get more than $50 worth you get a $20 um coupon so I think it's twenty dollars or twenty percent. I I'll check later. So I got this. This is let me put this on so y'all can see. I don't know if you can see it over top of my black shirt, but it's like a what they call it below below. And um, see, try to set. And then the back of it. Okay. Yeah. And let me show y'all the sleeve of it. Nice. And it's made out of that knit, that sweater material. I wish I could. Well, I got one in brown. But I got like a pattern to it. So, yeah. And I wanted to wear that with this. Because y'all know I got the ruffle below, but, um, below whatever they call them. I had a ruffle one, but I didn't think it would go with the shirt, so I needed a plan. And that was 40% off, but I'm not quite sure how much. Because, um, they didn't mark, it didn't have a markdown price. and marked down at the register. I'm thinking I ain't paying no more than probably $9 for that. Uh, and this right here was $18.74 plus 40% off. It's a ruffle shirt. And spaghetti strap. And in the back it has, y'all know for us plus size girl, we got large back, so. We need that extra elastic, and that's what it has, which I really didn't need it because it draped on me anyway. I bought it bigger than what I wear, so, because I got all this in front, so I want to make sure it's bigger, and that I'm going to wear with the, um, this, my little velour, and it looked really cute when I put this belt around it, too. I'll show y'all when I get, when I wear it and dress up. I'm going out, me and my honey kind of having um, arguments, I don't know why, but it's something stupid at a Passover, and we supposed to go on a date on Friday and Saturday, so I wanted to get some cute pieces to wear for them two days, oh, let me show y'all what else I got, and this, and I'm going to show y'all my outfit of the day for them two days. And Sunday, because I'm going to church Sunday. So, we're going to be moving it. This sweater is $22.49. Regular $29.99. And 40% off of that $22.49. So, and I'll give you an extra little button here. And let me show y'all the price tag. Which y'all probably can't see anyway. But this sweater is the cutest, let me tell you. You see, can y'all see? Y'all see that pocket on it? It has a little pocket. Y'all see how it um opens up in the front and the yoke of the neck. Y'all see the neck part? Ain't it cute? It has one button up here and it opens up. And the sleeve just enough to hide this that thing right there <laughs> but still show the arm and I'm gonna put this underneath it I still haven't figured out the pants parts y'all so y'all see when I put it on I'll do an outfit of the day they had these um, 